Hey guys, this is Kent from the Games Den. Today we're playing MotoGP 21 and I'm happy to get my copy early. I'm going to try and give you guys a video every day. So today we're going with Joan Mir and it's in Argentina and we are on medium difficulty. I know you guys love my pronunciations. How about this then? Termas de Rio Honda. That's the name of the track. <laughs> Don't forget, I'm from London, England. This is as good as it gets. All right, so let's go for practice and qualifying because you need to do third practice if you are good there. If you're in the top 10, then you'll find yourself in skipping to, to qualifying two. Fans. Just a few moments and the third MotoGP free practice round will begin. Another 45 minutes and we will find out which riders will be the 10 who will go directly to the second qualifying session. There you go, just what I said. Okay, so this is a preview build. I'm playing this on my PC. It's a preview build, so there may be some glitches in it and sometimes the AI will absolutely go straight through you and that's going to be patched before... The game is released, but I just wanted to be upfront about that. I hasn't remembered my setup. It seems like I've got to do a setup for each different track. Whereas in last year's game, I was lucky enough to be able to use the same setups from track to track. Now, I'm not sure if that will stay or not. Here's my, see, you're getting all my secrets now. This is my painted tid gearing system that I'm using. It won't work on every track because it uh, depends on how long the straights are. I'm going to go with the biggest brake discs I can get. Yeah. And at ECU I'll leave that. All right, let's start qualifying. The mechanics are taking the bike out of the pit and the rider is getting ready to get on. Let's see if some interesting information comes from the configuration. It hasn't given me max power. That's weird, I'll have to try and change that. There we go. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. <laughs> I was so busy looking at the configuration. I don't think this is back far enough. Oh, there we go. Our lap hasn't started till we go over the start-finish line. I'm definitely finding it tough adjusting my braking. I find that I have to go much earlier than I think I have to. Oh, that was fun. He just managed to... I'm going to have to get past this dude now. This is going to be cat and mouse for the whole lap now, I guarantee it. I reckon I've got enough on him here. If you are new to the channel, it'd be wicked if you could subscribe and join us on our MotoGP journey. I'll definitely be playing a lot of this game. I might actually try the other brake setup because, like I said, one of the toughest things is how early I'm having to come off the power. Alright, so 
Mr. Mir. That is my time. Let's see this practice if it's enough. This practice coming to a close. Let's see the graphic of which riders managed to get the best time. Yeah, it was enough. And like I said, this is on medium, so. With the end of this third session of free practice, we have the names. Welcome Maybe I'm back, being too hard fans. on myself. The second qualifying session is starting, and things are getting a bit more intense now. All right, second qualifying. It should remember my setup. Yep. Let's make sure I save it. There we go. I'll have a setup for every track at this rate. There he is getting on the. You see, I was desperate trying to get away from that guy there. Last thing I want someone just in front of me. Max Lane, Max Lane. <laughs> All right, 140. Well, that I pretty much smashed it there. Hang on, look, I can go to the pit. He has returned to the pit, but we can't tell whether he is satisfied with what. He... Oh, I'm satisfied. Here's the live session. So yeah, eight seconds up. Let's see how they do in the race. That's the end of the second and last qualifying session, and we can finally see the grid positions that await us in tomorrow's Grand Prix. Hello and welcome to the Termas de Rio Hondo circuit in Argentina Termas de Rio. for live coverage of the MotoGP race. The weather is great and the temperature is perfect for racing. So we're just waiting to find out which riders have opted for hard tyres and which riders have opted for soft. We're live from the starting grid where the cameras are lingering on the favourite riders for today. A few minutes to go and finally the spectacle will begin. All right, let's get to it. Everything here is ready to start the race at Terminus hmm. de Rio Hondo. Riders just have I'm recording this as line. live, so if I do get ruined by the AI, like if they just completely keep taking me out, which has happened on some other races, I will be doing a rewind, because otherwise this is only three laps, it's impossible to pull it back if you get wiped out. I 
I'm kind of keeping out of trouble there. Leave a little gap for me up this side. Oi, 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 oi! Oh, maximum breaking then. He's really lucky. He's really lucky I didn't knock him off. He just jumped in front of me. He might say he was closing the gap, but he wasn't. Lap two. Okay, so tomorrow's race will be on hard difficulty. Let's see what happens. I will find my level. I would imagine it will be, that will be it tomorrow. I'll be surprised if I go higher. But I didn't think I'd be doing this well on medium to be honest. In my test runs that I've done, I've like done a few test runs just for checking out the sound and the bike noise and everything. And I've come off the bike like multiple times, so it's funny that these runs that I've posted so far, I mean I'm massively tempting fate saying this, I'll probably spend the whole of the third lap on the grass or on my ass. I mean that is full braking there, that is not just tapping the brake, that is full braking. I'm going to have an advantage over you guys because by the time you guys play this I'll have had it for over a month. So I'll be looking forward to taking you on in the online races on my channel. Now I know some of you are rapid fast, like rapid fast. Okay, so I've now got a pretty much a 10 second gap. Happy days! You got the win. Before going to the podium award ceremony, let's take a look at the final MotoGP 13 second results. gap overall. Really surprised about that. Really surprised. It was, a perfect it was a good run, though. In addition to the victory, his position also earns him 25 priceless championship points. Here we are for the podium ceremony. 
It's a weekend where everyone gave their all. But today, he's a good looking fella, isn't he? That they had a little bit of... All right, guys. Tomorrow, we're going to go hard difficulty and ramp it up. If there's anything else you want to see, drop us a note in the comments and I'll do my best. Be wicked if you could subscribe to the channel. If you want to support the channel, right next to subscribe is the join button and there you can become a member and get access to all the exclusive features of being a member thanks very much guys i'll see you tomorrow